All right, what's up guys? Um, I don't really have much planned for today, but I thought I would maybe vlog it. So I'm gonna take some Instagram pictures, maybe go to thrift, I don't know, we'll see. Don't really know, I'm kind of feeling the new breads. I just got these, these are my all time grail shoes. I think I'm gonna wear these. For the Instagram picture, I'm gonna go for like a vintage vibe. So I got like some vintage looking jeans. They're not really vintage, but they kind of look vintage. I don't know, it's the best I got. Decide between either vintage Tommy shirt or the vintage polo. Hmm. I don't really know. Or do I just scratch the whole vintage vibe and wear the cactus jack? Hmm. Okay, so I decided on the vintage polo, but also little, sorry, my closet's hella messy. Does this, does this bother you guys? Let me know when you hook it like that versus like the normal way. I don't really even see like any of a difference. My girlfriend goes freaking crazy. So let me know if that's weird. <laughs> freaking made it. Okay, so uh, we're going to Starbucks, but that's besides the point. Um, the off-white Jordan 4s dropped today and both of us struck out and got screwed. But it seems like <laughs> more and more more people are getting into like reselling and people who don't even care about sneakers are on the sneakers app just trying to hit and make a quick buck. So like that just screws everybody. I don't even know if you can bot the sneakers app, but you might be able to. But like seems like everybody's got like four accounts or five accounts and it's just like you can't hit on literally anything like sneakers app is supposed to be like the most fair i don't even think it's that you never hit i just like that's not what annoys me the most what annoys me is like everybody saying like the, it's the same thing every weekend no matter what drops that everybody's always posting like oh my god like sneakers app i can't believe i didn't hit again like can you honestly tell me you thought you were gonna hit this time like don't be posting about I don't believe that, like, no, you believe it. You knew you weren't going to get it. Like, this is not a but, surprise. Why are you posting the same thing every weekend when you don't get any of the shoes? Like, go. It's, it's worth a shot, but, like. It's worth a shot, but if you don't get it, you don't need to be posting about what kind of bull is because you can't honestly tell me that you really thought you were going to be able to get them. Also, I think this would be a good time to share all the sneakers that I've hit on just the sneakers app, nowhere else. Have you hit anything ever on the sneakers app? Um, I hit the... Jordan 11 breads, but they were for him, not for me, so. Yeah, well, my sneakers account got suspended once for like a month, so she actually hit on the bread 11s for me. Uh, I've also got the Jordan 1 Fearless UNC to Chicago. I got those for retail on the sneakers app, and I got the Court Purples, uh, like the 2.0 Court Purples. I got those on the sneakers app too. I think that's all that I've hit on on the sneakers app, to be that's honest. Still, that's more than a lot of people can say. I've never yeah, hit on anything for me. That's for more than like the average, but like at the time, the Fearless UNC to Chicago and the Court Purples, they weren't like nobody was selling those for that much money. Like they were considered like bricks, like when they came out. So not near as many people were going for them, but now they're like a high dollar shoe. What's up, guys? <laughs> We got to Starbucks, got my caramel macchiato. That's my go-to, what do you guys get? Like, put me on some some good drinks. I always get the iced caramel macchiato all the time. And I absolutely love it when the guy gets caramel all over the side of the drink and it gets all over your hands. I love that. We're at Goodwill. Usually there's like nothing cool in Kansas, like at any thrift shop. It, like anything in Kansas is just like not cool. So we'll see. Yeah, and also for some reason, it literally, we had it. Like it took us 10 minutes to find a parking spot. I don't know why it's so busy. I didn't know like coming to Goodwill on a Saturday afternoon was a popular activity around here. Yeah, it's like booming. Um, but I guarantee you it's because of TikTok because all the girls in our area are watching our good fish shopping and then so. Hey, you know the vibes, got the bread toast. And the breads? Stop playing with some all black harachis. These things are cooked. <laughs> We got these. These look like those new off-whites that are coming out. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> we found a come up. Heelys. Freaking Heely. Got some Harachis with no insole. Are, and they're, they're cooked. Roshis, not Harachis. 
Yeah, this is what you get when you come to the Kansas Goodwill. Bro, what even are those? Got like a whole lot of nothing. Saturdays, what the hell? Like whatever that is. It's cool, bro. Freaking Nike shirt with the Nike like ripped off. It's cool. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Fendi? No, nah, you thought. Freaking got a cool polo though. It's cool. It's like stretchy. I don't dig that. Got them fresh Kirkland jeans. It's literally the same logo they put on like water. Don't they make like chocolate milk and shit? Why do they got jeans? <laughs> oh shit. They're like pink LeBrons. I don't know if they're like breast cancer. I don't know if they're like worth anything. That could be a come up. I don't know. Bro, these look like they're like super retro. Like, jeez. Like press your finger in and it like stays in. These are cool, but they're like toast. Bruh. Take these out to the honky tonk. <laughs> Big Birkin bag, whole five, six figures. <laughs> Box ain't nothing even in it. Somebody just jacked the otter box. <laughs> Yeehaw, brother. We found the otter box. <laughs> It is a mess. Yo, this is sick. It's like an Iowa crew neck. Like vintage. It has a real hot guy on there. Oh, that's cool. This is kind of dope. Freaking cash out on the mink. You know the vibes. Jeez. What in the... It's like a... What the... It's a frozen... It's Elsa's hair. What the... We're about to peace. There's like what? nothing cool in here. Alright, uh, we just left. There's like nothing cool in there, like at all. Like, Cause we're in Kansas. Also, uh, when you leave, there's hand sanitizer by the door. And you put it on and it's like, it's just soap. Like it's not hand sanitizer, it's literally just soap. It doesn't like blend into your hand, it's just there. It just smells like soap. Alright, so now we're gonna take Instagram pictures. I've really been uh, trying to get up on my Instagram game, honestly. Because I take all your pictures. Yeah, so pretty much the layout is we drive around and we find somewhere cool to take a picture. And then I make her sit out here and it's like 100 degrees and take pictures of me. This is the spot we found. It's like hidden back here, like in this parking lot. But I think it'll turn out cool. I just scraped the out of the back of these on the leather. So that's awesome. And she's sitting down taking pictures of me. It's usually how it goes. We're on the topic of shoes, like taking pictures of my shoes. The one, there's like, I love Jordan ones, but there's like a couple things that I hate about them. First off is when the tongue like goes over off to the side that off so much. And another thing that I don't like is when the heel is like all crunched down. Like that just makes me so mad. Another thing, Cali spread toes. Uh, we got these on the same day, actually. We both got bread toes on the same day. And she got these size seven, no box for 220. Like they're used, but like they weren't like cooked. Like they were good condition. 220, no box. I got mine for, uh, they were 370 and they were like VNDS, like all the stars were there. And I traded some Yeezys, the Yeezy uh, 350 Zebras. I traded those and like 70 bucks for my bread toast. And they came with like OGL. Okay, so after I take my pictures, I always take a picture of like the shoes with it because like that's what my following is based around is like shoes. So like the last picture on the Instagram will be like, like the shoes that I'm wearing, like just up close, you know? All right, now we are like apartment shopping because we want to move into our own place and get our own like apartment. So uh, in a couple months, so that's like really boring. So you guys probably don't care about that. I also might go ride dirt bikes later. Also, I don't think you guys care about me riding dirt bikes. I actually race like motocross. <laughs> Fun fact, but uh, yeah. So I think I'm just gonna end it here because the rest of my day is pretty boring. So, um, peace, we'll see you guys.